All right, uh, let's look at the worksheet number one, problem number nine. All right, so uh, we have information about the m plus n, which is 24, and m minus n plus p is equal to 15, and we have to somehow come up with the value for 4m plus 2p. All right. All right, so here's um, uh, uh, you, uh, what we, we should uh, notice first. All right, so it looks like we're only talking about m and p. We're interested in m and p, so we don't want n. All right, so so think about getting rid of n. All right, so uh, if you have uh, m plus n is equal to 24, so that's the first clue. All right, second clue said that uh, m minus n uh, plus p is equal to uh, 15. Right, and I'm going to actually move uh, things a little bit. So I'm going to just uh, move this guy over so that uh, equality lines up. All right, so uh, what, what's the easiest way to get rid of n? All right, so, uh, so easiest way would be since you have positive n and a negative n, so we can just add them up. All right, so if you add them up, you have a 2m. All right, and the, these two guys uh, cancel out, so you got nothing, and then you have you still have p. All right, and uh, let's see, four plus five is nine, and two plus one is three, so you have thirty-nine. All right, All right, then we're interested in four m plus two p. We don't quite have that, but this is only a half of what we want. So what you can do is um, uh, multiply by 2. That way you get uh, 2m times 2 is 4m. Uh, p times 2 is 2p. And uh, 39 times 2 is 78. All right? So therefore, the value is 78. All right? That's it. I hope that uh, this was clear.